Hello, my dear ones. I got some wonderful happy mail from my sweet friend Emma of My Creative Time, and I wanted to come on and share it with you. Uh, she is so sweet to have sent this to me. I love this little envelope, and this is a die that I have in my stash, and I'm sure a lot of you have it. Um, but look at how cute this is, and this is using some of her new release products that she just came out with last Friday, and uh, I love this little ginger. Isn't that adorable, you guys? So easy to put together, and it, it comes with this little envelope, uh, like it's holding a little Valentine letter, and I love how she used this um, uh, sparkly or... Uh, not sparkly cardstock, but foiled cardstock for the bow because it really glints. And then this beautiful uh, Valentine heart die. Uh, she did a set of dies in honor of Ginger Rop, um, who passed away from COVID. And uh, so I'm going to show you those in a minute. But look at how cute this card is. She says, Happy Val Valentine's Day. Enjoy my friend. And it's from Emma. And I love how she put the little three hearts in here. So isn't that adorable, you guys? So I love the presentation. This is her round card die set that she used to create the card, and I love this die set too, and uh, I also have it. So um, she sent me that, and then look what she sent with it, this little hugs and kisses, and inside this little treat thing, she has two little Kit Kats, so raspberry cream Kit Kats. Isn't that adorable? And it closes right here with this little tab, you just slip it into the slot. So that is just so cute and easy to make, and I love the little stitching detail that she has on here. So you open it up and then she just has these glued down with a glue dot. Isn't that sweet? So just adorable. I love that. So sweet. Emma, thank you so much for sending this to me. This was just so kind of you. Um, so she sent me the release and uh, some other things too. So this is the Wonky Heart Dies. And if you go to her My Creative Time channel, she has videos using everything that you're going to see. Um, uh, her channel's wonderful. She always shows her products and gives you ideas on how to use them. So you can see, um, you know, like these little hearts right here are what she put on the inside here. So these little hearts right here. And then these beautiful wonky stitch dies. Um, that little heart right there is what she used right here. And the hugs and kisses on there is using this beautiful stamp set that's called Sending Love. And you're going to see this stamp set and another and one of the dies here, this die that I am featuring in this week's episode of Saturday Morning Makes. So I'm excited to show you what I made with these. Um, but this stamp set is like the quintessential Valentine's Day stamp set, but it can be used all year round because so many of the sentiments like love you lots, you make my heart smile, you're in my heart, love you, hugs and kisses um, in two different ways, sending love. There's just so many things that you could use all year round. Um, I also love that she included a little XOXO, you are loved. Um, she has this I love you in this tic-tac-toe, which I used on my projects for Saturday morning. Um, and then it says also, hello, my love, I'm yours. So just so many things she's got a to and from in here on top of that, as well as a cancellation stamp. So it just has everything. And one of my favorites is Happy Galentine's Day. And that's so fun to use with your gal pal friends. Um, so just wonderful. It's got gorgeous font for all of these. It's just a beautiful, beautiful stamp set. And you can pause the video if you'd like to read each one of the sentiments and look at it a, really, a little bit closer. So I use this, and again, it's called Sending Love, and uh, the number is MCT379, and you'll see that on Saturday morning for my Saturday morning makes, and I also use these scalloped heart tag dies, which are MCTD259. So um, these two products she sent, and I use these um, in my Saturday morning makes you're going to see tomorrow morning. Um, I was working on them today, which is Friday. So uh, she also sent this beautiful set. These are called Ginger's Doily Dyes. These were made in honor of Ginger, who passed away from COVID. And uh, these turned out so beautiful. And I love how she used, see how she used it on here. So this is that die right there. And uh, this just turned out so cute. And you can see this die on here. So this perfect, this is made to perfectly fit her circle cards. So just a wonderful die set to have and so cute for Valentine's Day, especially with this sweet little ginger. So those are the ginger's doily dies. And then um, this is the gingerbread set that you see here. So here's this sweet little ginger. I love how she did the outline on this. 
and uh, you can see the outline dies and there you can have the ginger facing either way depending on what you do and uh, she has all the pieces here the little heart buttons regular buttons the bow for the head or a bow tie she's got the frosting pieces the eyes and uh, you know to make the cute cheeks and eyes and mouth and uh, and then a little letter for it to hold and she puts one of the little hearts right here which is adorable so I cannot wait to play with this set, but since she had already done this adorable card and it's so precious, I just thought I would show you that and use something else for my um, Saturday uh, episode. So this is just so charming, Emma. You did such a sweet job designing these products. I just love this. And I cannot wait to get my circle die out and make a few of these for my family and friends. So um, wonderful products. And then you can see this is the actual die that I showed you, the little treat thing. And it's called Pocket Treat Die. MCT D399. So that's a wonderful thing to have. And think of all the different things you could put in here. Um, it also fits the square um, candies uh, oh, from Ghirardelli. They fit in here perfectly because she showed that on her one of her videos on her channel. But you could do so many things. You could put little craft supplies in here to send to a friend. You know, when you're doing Happy Mail and uh, close it up, you could, you know, you could do so many different things that would fit in there. So I just thought this was really charming. And, uh, and then she also sent this Thanks a Whole Bunch. Um, this is a kind of a donut themed stamp, but it, it really has so many things in it that you can use all the time. So I love that it has happy birthday to my sweet friend. You make life sweet for a sweet teacher, sweet birthday wishes. Don't worry, be happy or do not worry, be happy. So you can see all the sentiments in this one and this adorable little donut die with the sweet. So that's going to be fun to play with, especially because my dad loves donuts. And uh, I love to do these types of projects for him Um you know, when he's having a birthday or something. And then she also sent me the bunch of fun circle dies. Now, those of you uh, that watched me do that uh, Peachy Keen release where I I used this to make the snowball of the snowman face. Um, and she brought these back out. And that was sweet of her to send me this and uh, the updated die set. And then she also sent these ones, which are the heart label dies. And these are really cute because they have these little heart punch outs as well as stitching. And then you can layer them on top of the bigger size. So she's got all the sizes so that you can layer them. So beautiful, beautiful products from My Creative Time. Emma, thank you so much for sending me all this. I was not expecting you to do that. And uh, it was very, very kind of you. And I'm so excited to play with all of these. And I especially, I had so much fun. You guys saw I made some snowman circle cards on one of my episodes of Saturday Morning Makes. And I just had so much fun making these. It's so easy to cut these out and then they decorate up really quick. And uh, now I have these um, heart and different circle dies that I can decorate the front of them even more easily. So I'm really excited to play with all these and I just love these little um, projects that Emma sent. So, so adorable and uh, just really charming. And I love that her envelope that I already have fits this so perfectly. So, um, and I think I showed that also on one of my um, on one of my previous episodes of Saturday Morning Makes. So you'll see on Saturday Morning Makes tomorrow where I show uh, this set and these and what I made with them. So I look forward to um, seeing what you guys uh, all make this weekend. Uh, and I'm excited to share my Saturday Morning Makes um, as I finish them up tonight and uh, share them early tomorrow morning. I'm gonna do a 6 a.m. premiere video and uh, so I will see you all then for sure, okay? Thank you again, Emma, for making crafting so much fun for me and for everybody that loves your products at My Creative Time. Um, and my very best wishes for a happy Valentine's Day for you and your family. Um, and big hugs to your mom, too, and uh, thinking of all of you. And uh, uh, my condolences to Ginger's family, to Sherry's family. I'm still thinking and praying for all of the families that have lost people to COVID or any other difficult illness um, or circumstances. Uh, it's, it's very hard when we lose those we love. And uh, I pray that we always feel their love surrounding us because love never ends. So everybody take good care. Bye now.